Right, I know that he had a window in there as well. Just about there. I'm just gonna, that door's not exactly straight, so you can just adjust that. You can always adjust everything that you do, more or less. Just sort of pull down. Whoa, that didn't work. Doesn't matter though, like I told you, it's an old rustic door, you can just twist it up like so. That's good, that's nice. That's the effect that I was trying to achieve. Get a bit of brown on the end of the knife. We're going to have a window just up the very top edge here. Just there. I might even put a bit of light in there. Because he's got a fire roaring. And then he had one that looked out onto the lake just here. What a thing to wake up to in the morning. Looking at that beautiful, beautiful lake. Now that window had quite a thing around it. So I'm just going to run through the brown and white on the small edge of the knife, cut across that and then use that as I have been doing just to line the edge of the window. Steady hand you need for this. And the old hand nearly let me down then. And now I'll just run one down. There. Still not bright enough. It's not bright enough, you can just run through liquid white. Try that. There. Right, you can neaten that up afterwards. Don't you stress about it. You can neaten it up with a little liner brush afterwards. You notice I do things and I'm, they might look a bit scruffy now, but you'll see. It'll totally and it'll transform that. Now, another little window just in there. I'm just going to leave that dark, straight black. I think we'll call it at that for today. What I'll do is because I'm out of batteries. So. Take care everyone and I'll see you tomorrow.